Hey guys, hey guys. It's your favorite girl, Tanisha. Make sure you subscribe as soon as you watch my videos, guys. And make sure you comment, like, share. You know, I'm trying to get to 10,000 subscribers. So guys, remember, every day, you need something that's going to get you excited. Like, I'm excited right now. I'm not going to tell you guys, but I'm excited <laughs> right now. Like, I'm happy. I'm about to go get me some green tea uh, from Panera Bread with some avocado. I'm going to get an avocado sandwich. Um, I think they got some garlic spread. and pick up my grandmother. And I'm excited, guys, because this revolution, evolution, it's not even a revolution. Les Brown said, and Robert Kiyosaki said, it's a revolution. Now, I don't think it's a revolution. I think it's an evolution because we are evolving, right, with this new money and this new, uh, you know, cryptocurrency. And, uh, you know, here's the thing, guys. They, they My mentor said, the way that you get rich is you get ahead of the trends, right where everybody going left you go right everybody go right you go left right so you get ahead of these trends and bitcoin is one of the trends imagine in 1998 when the internet came out and you was a part of that trend imagine that okay imagine if you were part of that trend just imagine okay what you could have accomplished already how much millions of dollars you would have made or just imagine if you were one of those people that mark called okay mark said let me show you something i want to talk to you about a, a opportunity that can change the way we communicate would you have been one of those five people that went to mark house because remember there's only two people that went to mark house and then right now the winkle bosses okay it's <laughs> a the winkle bosses you know they have their own mining exchanges right now with bitcoin so remember, guys, how do you get rich? You get ahead of the trends, okay? You know those little fidgets, those fidget spinners, those things? Those are people that's opportunists. You know how much money whoever created that made? They made a lot of money. And then now they got these little finger, these little fingerling things. People make a lot of money. You get ahead of the trends, guys, okay? So for you guys that say, you know, you ready, you call me and say, oh, I'm getting my coins together, I'm getting my money ready so I can do e-commerce, so I can do Bitcoin, guys, here's the thing. If it's important to you, you would do it right away. If it's important to you, you would do it right away. You would sacrifice eating for a week to do something that you truly want. You would sacrifice Okay, you will sacrifice your car note, your car insurance, your whatever for the month, okay, if it's a priority and it matters to you, right? You cannot say, I'm trying to get my money up all year. No, you're not serious, guys, right? People people call me, see, that's why only I like to deal with serious people who got money, they ready, you know, to invest in themselves, they ready to win, right? So you got to be ready to win. And the only way you be ready to win is if you are ready to invest in yourself, right? People ask me all the time, how much is my Amazon? Well, I tell people $500, right? Now, if you're not willing to invest $500, that's fine. But don't call me wasting time. Don't call me with a sob story. Don't call me with your drama. Call me with your dreams, right? Tanisha, my dream is to have financial independence. My dream is to spend time with my kids. My dream is to, you know, do videos from my car. My dream is to, uh, you know, be able to have money and take my kids, you know, on trips or, you know, whatever the case may be. Okay. Okay. Whatever the case is. All right. Call me with your dreams and let's help, right? Me and you get a plan and say, how can we help you fulfill your dreams? Now you need money. <laughs> There's no getting around that part. You need money, right? And the problem with money is that most people, right, look over, right, look over the important things. See, bills are really not important because they're residual and they're going to come. What's important is you gaining some residual income so that you can now pay your bills on time or whenever you need to pay your bills or pay your bills six months in advance, Okay, how about paying your bill six months in advance and not worrying about, oh, I'm six months behind, right? So if it's important to you guys and it's a priority to you, freedom is priceless, right? 500 would be nothing. 2,000 would be nothing, okay? You dropping, you know, 10 grand into your BitConnect account will be nothing. 
right? But when it's not a priority, it's going to take you all year to get up 500. It's going to take you all year to get up 2,000. It's going to take you all year just to start. You know, people call me and say, Tanisha, I'm mentally ready, but not financially. Then you're not ready at all. Because vision says you got to see it in your mind first, and then you go lay the foundation. You see it in your mind first, and then you go lay the foundation. Say, how can I afford this? What credit cards do I need to use? You know, how many meals do I need to miss so that I can sacrifice for my future? Because, like I said, guys, the only way that anything is going to happen for you is if you put the first foot forward. Nothing's going to happen miraculously. Nothing just happens, right? And if you have the mentality of entitlement that, oh, they, everything's supposed to be given to me, I can guarantee you're broke, you're destitute, and you're behind on your bills. Because the entitlement mentality never works. And working hard on your job never works either. How do people work for 20 years on their job and don't have no money? How the fuck do you work on your job for 20 years and you still ain't got no money? What the fuck? So working hard doesn't work. Cops work too hard, they broke. Judges work too hard, they're broke. Lawyers work too hard, they're broke. Nurses work too hard, they're broke. Teachers work too hard, they're broke. See, working hard doesn't work unless you're working on something like your own business, right? So if you're working overtime on your Amazon business and you put in 12 hours a day, guess what? Oh, oh you can make unlimited sales. Yeah, so if you're working on your Bitcoin business and understanding how this cryptocurrency is going to help your life and your family's life become better, guess what? You're going to reap the benefits. But working hard to help somebody else build their dream doesn't work. Going to school to learn outdated information because I think college is outdated information right so going to school to pay thousands of dollars to learn outdated information you know how much people have college degree don't have a job I have a college degree I don't have a job but that's by choice but a lot of people don't have jobs uh, you know not by choice is because they, they can't find a fucking job they can't even find a fucking job So if you really want it, guys, make it happen. Make it a priority. What is freedom, right? Like Harriet Tubman said, you know, she could free more slaves only if they knew they were slaves, right? What is freedom worth to you? And spend your heart, your hard-earned time, money, energy into obtaining it. Do whatever you got to do, guys. Right? Because reality is, if you have a job, you're a slave to your job. If you go to school, right, college, you're a slave to the school because now you got a bill to pay. Right? If you're a slave to your job, guys, and if you have one income, you are a slave. Right? I pray every day, right, that at least 10 people, right, I, I, I'm able to help at least 10 people wake up. Okay? That, that, that's what I pray every morning, right? That I, that, that I help at least 10 people wake up a day to becoming better, to becoming free, and understanding that life is to be lived abundantly and fulfilled and to be excited. You know how much people are depressed every day, hate going to their jobs? You know how much people wake up every day wanting to kill themselves? You know how much people wake up hoping and praying and wishing they get hit by a car? Or something bad happened to them so they won't have to go to work. Alright? Get excited about something, guys. So if freedom is a priority to you, then you should be already putting your best foot forward. You should be already investing your time, energy, and money. Now, if you're over 30 years old, now is the time to change your ways. Because at 50, you're already setting your ways. And if you don't have no assets, you don't have no money working for you, at 50, you just going to work until you die, and that's your life. That's it. How many people work at Walmart after they retire working a job for 40 years? Because they never learned how to have money work for them. If you're 30 years old, you're a millennial, right? You need to learn now, change your ways, so that you can have money working for you. So by the time you're 50, you're retired, and you have money working for you. Or you're doing volunteer work, or you know whatever you want to do. And not have a strain and stress. 
There's a lot of people 65 and over who want to commit suicide because they don't have no money. A lot of people 65 and over, guys, literally live in social security check to social security check, and it's not enough. So a lot of older people, 65 and over, guys, went to live back with their kids because they can't afford their house anymore. They can't afford their car anymore. They can't afford anything anymore because now the cost of living has went up and their income went down. Shit don't make no sense. Guys, you work your whole life for your income to drop drastically? See, that shit don't make sense. Whoever came up with that shit doesn't make sense. That's why so many people are destitute, guys, but I only can help those who are willing to listen. If freedom is a priority, you want to get started with Amazon, it's 500. If freedom is a priority, get started with BitConnect. Come, come up with a, a, a thousand dollars, right? You, you, you want freedom, right? You want to join a business, a physical product business, TLC, right? Come in with 500, okay? But a lot of people don't like to recruit. A lot of people don't like to, you know, sell, feel salesy. So that's why e-commerce is the wave. Even Damon John talks about this, guys. I made about $95,000 part-time with Amazon, friends. In this one year. Okay, who knows how much I made with, with Bitcoin. It's just Bitcoin is just blowing my mind. I can't even sleep Think about Bitcoin. Okay, so at the end of the day, guys, do something that's going to get you excited about your life, about living again, right? Now, if you don't, then guess what? <laughs> You're going to be 80, 90, 100. Fuck, fuck 80, 90, 100. You ain't even going to make 80, 90, 100 because you probably kill yourself, right? If you're 30 years old, change your ways right now. If you're 40 years old, change your ways right now. If you're 50, you got one foot in grave and you got another one in quicksand. And you gotta find a way to get up out the dead, to raise that one foot out the dead and to learn how to get that other foot, okay, out the quicksand, guys. I'm only 34 years old, guys. I've learned, right, to change my ways when I was 27 years old. A lot of people think I'm older because I'm wise. But at the end of the day, guys, I only can help those who are willing to listen. So if you want to start you a business part-time, Amazon, making $1,000 a month, guys, createyourownEconomy.com. I'm only looking to work with serious people, friends. See you soon.